the flam is up? Drum heads. We all love Instagram. We all have our favorite drummers on Instagram. Today, I'm gonna show you my favorite drummers on Instagram. Now, I'm gonna exclude like the obvious ones. 100,000 subscribers and above. Adam Tuminaro, Mike Johnston, Woj Tech Derogowski, Ciro's Vaziri, Anna Canals, Nillis. Those are just popular people that you might know already. So in this video, I kinda wanna show you the drummers you may not already be following. You know, that way you can check them out. Those are the drummers that I'm interested in, you know, the ones that have like less than 20,000 followers and they're kicking ass. Those are the people that I wanna follow on Instagram. All right, so let's get into it. I'm gonna start from the person who's the least followed to the person who's the most followed, okay? First person you should follow on Instagram is me, motherfucker. What? The first person they should follow is me. How narcissistic. Well, I'm trying to get to 10,000, and if I get to 10,000, then I can do that little swipey up thing in the stories, you know what I'm yeah, talking yeah, about? I, I know what you're talking about, okay? Th this isn't for you, it's for other people. I'm just trying to help you out, dude. You're the one who's always telling me how unpopular you feel because no one's watching your Instagram. Hey! Moving on! The first Instagram drummer on this list with 3.4 thousand followers, James Murphy. So nasty. He's a professor at Berkeley. I think he was one of Dave Cola's professors. Not sure. But yeah, I'm not sure how I found him on Instagram, but I love watching his videos. Something about that room with all the foam on the wall and the sound, the dry sound it produces, um, mixed with James's playing, obviously, makes them so enjoyable to watch and there's something so satisfying about the way he plays his drums. So that is number one. Next on the list, Chris Paprota. Paprika? Paprota. He only has 5,700 followers on Instagram. He is an amazing musician. Just the way he phrases things and the way he sounds behind the kit. He's like a modern day Vinny Kaliuta slash, I don't even know what, I, I don't, but he has his own sound and it's so sick to listen to him. It's so sick to watch him. That's my number two, Chris Pepperota. Next up on the list, Eman Cervantes. Cervantes? Cervantes? I'm so white. E-Man plays drums for Andy Grammer. He's obviously a, an amazing drummer. He's always got such good sound and he's always experimenting with like different mics and different gear and all this stuff. He's got such sick like vintage gear. He's got the chops, he's got the pockets. Just a very satisfying Instagram account to follow. Next up on the list, this guy is a fucking maniac. I don't understand half the stuff that he plays, but it's so crazy. And you know, he knows exactly what he's playing, but I cannot follow this motherfucker. Andy Prado Jr. Man, he's on that list of like those guys. A lot of the guys on, on my list are on this other list of themselves, like the underground crazy chop drummer crew, the UCCDC, but he's on that list. He's always posting videos of him shedding, just jamming, hashing out ideas. You can just tell that this guy's brain is just on another level. If I could pick a drummer on this list that I want to play drums like, it would probably be Andy. Next up on my list, he's in that same Crazy Chop drummer crew, Mason Guidry.
Same thing goes for Mason. I watch his videos and I cannot understand what he is doing. <sighs> it's amazing and it's so fast and it's so clean. I just, how does someone, he's so freaking fast, he's got an amazing foot. What a weird compliment. I like his feet. <laughs> Next up on the list, Devin Sumner. Devin's always posting cool clips. There's something so aesthetically pleasing about his videos and the way it looks, you know. He's always exploring new ideas and sharing practice clips and stuff like that, and uh, I think that stuff's really cool. So, Devin, how to put you on the list. Next up on my list, I just discovered this drummer, and her name is Madden Class. I don't know how I found her. I think I was scrolling through the explore page and she is an amazing player. There's something about her playing that just seems so controlled and she knows exactly what she's doing. Kind of reminds me of a Sarah Thawer. Shout out, she's not on this list. But she's one of those power drummers, you know, that like know what the f they're doing. Ana Canillas, you know, same thing. But the way they play, you're just like, yeah, I approve 100%. Next up, we got another member of the Underground Crazy Chop drummer crew, Forrest Rice. I've known Forrest for a long time now. I went to his house, we shedded before, super fun, super nice guy, super chilled, super good drummer, super come up with a different fucking adjective, Brandon, how about that? Forrest knows his shit behind the kit. There's not much else to say. Crazy, crazy shutter, amazing groove, plays in the dopest bands, plays the music that he enjoys. He started the high cymbal movement. He's the reason everyone's raising their cymbals up to the sky. We owe a lot to Forrest Rice. Next up, Jaka Cinco. Quattro Cinco says Jaka Cinco. Where's Jaka from? Slovenia. He's always posting sick content, always posting clips, always, always, always. And he just started a YouTube channel. I'll put the link to it somewhere. Check it out. He's always posting little quick lessons up there on Instagram. Yeah, so check out Jaka. All right. The last one on this list, uh, he's kind of way higher up there compared to everyone else. He has 47,000 followers on Instagram, and that is Raghav Me Mehrotra. Raghav Mehrotra. What's up with these weird last names, man? Why can't any of these people have normal names? This kid is amazing. I discovered him like, I don't know, six months ago. I just love his playing. It's so clean and I think he's like 12 or something. I don't know where these little kid prodigies are coming from. JD Beck, he's another one. <laughs> Same thing. How old is JD? Like 13? 14, something like that? Amazing. All right, I don't care about this top 10 anymore. There's just too many to list, okay? So I'm just gonna 
blow through this. And I'm gonna share with you guys the people that you should be following on Instagram. And if I miss anybody, put them in the comment section below because I wanna look them up too, okay? It's for all of us. This information is for all of us blowing through this. Carson Gant, One Up Drum Vids, Tosh Peterson, Brody Simpson, Austin Burcham, Eddie Thrower, David Cola, love you David. Wes Watkins, Estepario Sibiriano. Sibiriano, Sibiriano. Ugh, I could just go on and on. There's so many amazing drummers on Instagram. If I missed any, which I'm sure I have, I couldn't put everybody on this list, but regardless, put your favorite drummers in the comments below. I wanna check them out. And then also everyone else can check out the comment section and find some sick drummers on Instagram. Thanks for watching the video guys, hope you enjoyed. Check those people out. You don't have to check out my Instagram at Brandon Scott Drums if you don't if you don't want to. Not much to see on my Instagram, uh, Brandon Scott Drums. I finally hit 9,000 followers on my Instagram, Brandon Scott Drums. But yeah, I mean, I, I mainly just care about making YouTube videos. Uh, I don't really care about my Instagram, Brandon Scott Drums. So if you guys liked the video, hit the like, subscribe to YouTube, but don't uh, follow me on Instagram at Brandon Scott Drums. <laughs>